Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's take a look at this little clip. Pointing to Arabia and the Arabs as a nation that would inherit the kingdom of God can be seen in Genesis sixteen fourteen, which mentions a well called Beer Lachai Roy, which lies between Kadesh and Bered. Okay, these uh, intellectual scholars want you to believe that the well Beer Lachai which lies between Kadesh and Bered. <clears throat> happens to be the Zamzam well. Hmm. Well, let's read Genesis 16, why don't we? Here we look at Genesis 16, verse 7. Now the angel of the Lord found Hagar by a spring of water in the desert, a spring along the road to Shur. Where is Shur? I have no freaking clue, but... Okay... Let's take a look at this uh, this other section here. Ber Lahoe Kadesh Barne. Uh blah blah blah, the well of the living, one that seeth me, a fountain of water in the wilderness, the fountain in the way to Shur. Okay. This is chapter sixteen, verses seven through fourteen. All right, let's go look at Shur. I just happen to have it pulled up. Here here you go. Uh Genesis sixteen. Let's see, where is Shur? I do believe Shur, uh, no, Abraham was born in Ur, Ur Chaldean. So let's see where Bible Atlas is pointing us to. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, here is Shur, right here. It's where? Oh, I don't know, it looks like the Sinai Peninsula, don't you think? Uh, Mecca is way down here. Don't look like, don't look like, uh, don't look like Hagar was in Mecca. Uh, anybody would agree, disagree? I don't know. Okay, let's see, where is Mecca? Do we even have Mecca here? Looking for Mecca, looking for Mecca? Where are you, Mecca? Uh, there's Medina, there's Jeddah. There's, there's, Mecca is somewhere around here. So to go from here to here, well, that's a pretty good distance. Okay. Let's look at another one here. In Genesis 21, this is where um, Hagar is kicked out of um, Abraham's tribe. Okay. And he left her wandering in the wilderness of Beersheba. Okay. Now we know where sure is where is Beersheba and for that we need to go to the bees because you know to be or not to be that is the question oh here we go Beersheba whoops all right I got a little carried away Ah, here we go. Genesis twenty one fourteen. Genesis twenty one thirty one. Genesis twenty one thirty two. Genesis twenty one thirty three. Genesis twenty two. Blah blah. Let's go click on that little bad boy and see where that is. Google, do your magic. Take it away. Oh look, there's the Bersheba River. You know, I have a feeling Mecca is somewhere around here. Oh man, look at that city around Mecca. Oh my goodness. Right next to a cemetery too. Yeah. All right, let's let's let's. Oh look, Bersheba. Don't they stop? Oops, went a little bit too far. Oh 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 oh. Oh look at that! It's in Israel. Oh darn it! Where's Mecca? Oh Mecca, Mecca, where are you? I guess I'm gonna have to shrink this bad boy. Yeah, don't see Mecca yet. Oh look at that, Mecca. Mecca all the way down here. So we know that Shur is over here. We know that Beersheba is over here. But over here is uh, Mecca. And over here is Medina. Kind of a problem, don't you? Uh, let's just for, for fun. Uh, just, just, just for fun. Let's, let's see. Uh, measure the distance. 
we're going to put this right on Medina. And then we're going to stretch it out. Let me see what I put over there. And we're going to click over here. And let's stretch it out a little bit. Okay, I mean, it's only 546 miles. You can do that in a day. And now if we stretch it out to Mecca, I'm not even sure you could travel that way because it looks like it's all mountains. But we got Mecca somewhere around here. Uh, you know, put, put right there. Ooh, look at that, 749 miles. Let's say if you did, I don't know, 50 miles a day, which I kind of doubt. That's uh, 15 days travel. Now, not to mention that, uh, let me see, I think it's in Genesis 21. Is it Genesis 21? Oh, yeah. Uh, Hagar got a wife for Ishmael from Egypt. Okay. So if Ishmael and Hagar were in Mecca, gee, Egypt is over here. Now, did they cross here? Did they cross here? Or maybe they, they cross over here with the Exodus that's supposedly taking place. Or was it over here? Am I supposed to believe that Hagar went from here, went all the way up here, and then crossed over here? Now, did she get a wife from uh, Egypt and Sinai, or did she go up here and cross over here and go here somewhere? Who knows? Ladies and gentlemen, these people don't know what the hell they're talking about. Anyway, I'm done. I'm done exposing the stupidity as always. Oh, like, share, subscribe, don't like. And I'll be back like Arnold Schwarzenegger in The Terminator. I'll be back.